us story. Before a championship victory, a record-breaking run, a jaw-dropping turn, there's possibility. Possibility, an opportunity to step outside of yourself and to step into something greater. Whether it's proving to the doubters that you have what it takes. I'm here. I'm doing the work. Or proving to yourself that you know who you are and where you belong. We weren't asking for your permission. But to finish the story, you have to begin. And make it your own from who you are. To the choices you make along the way. And replace possibility with legend. Because this, this is your story. All right, guys, welcome back to another video. Today we're playing uh, WWE 2K24. So we're gonna do the my career mode. So if you guys enjoy, then don't forget to leave a like, and subscribe, and yeah. Let's get into it. All right. Let me go back. Uh, let's see. All right, we'll do that. Just so the so that you guys can still hear my commentary over the music. All right. Whoops! Didn't mean to do that. All right. Let's go into my rise. All right. We'll skip that. Let's do that. Hmm. Let's do this one. Welcome to The Bump and what is shaping up to be the most chaotic SummerSlam week in WWE history. I'm Byron Saxton. And I'm Kayla Braxton. Less than a week before defending the undisputed WWE Universal Championship against Cody Rhodes in a brand versus brand main event at SummerSlam, Roman Reigns shocked the world and surrendered his title. The head of the table said that he's been beating up Cody for years now and he has nothing more to prove. Now he's taking a sabbatical in Hollywood to show his cousin, The Rock, that he will be a bigger superstar there too. With SummerSlam in disarray and the draft set to begin the night after, Triple H called for a one-night WWE Universal title tournament with selections from the GMs of both Raw and SmackDown. Raw GM William Regal named Cody as Raw's first entrant and said he was confident the title would be coming to Raw. But SmackDown's brand new general manager, The Miz, didn't find this awesome. He called the attempt to take his WWE Universal Championship to Raw nothing short of theft. And The Miz is in it to win it for his brand. He's sending a team of killers to bring that title home. Let's take a look. Kayla, we know what Braun Strowman brings to a fight. AJ Styles is always a threat. If you ask me, though, KO is the man to beat in this whole tournament. He's been hungry for the opportunity. Reigns has left him here. That sounds like he was waiting for crumbs from Roman's table, Byron. William Regal's entries are no slouches. Finn Balor was the first Universal Champion. Much of the WWE Universe believes this is Gunter's time. And Cody Rhodes has been looking to finish the story for a while now. That last slot though, Kayla, what is Regal's strategy there? William Regal still has one foot in developing young superstars. Raw's GM is going to make a match on the SummerSlam kickoff show for that last slot in the tournament. Your guy, Kevin Owens. I mean, I wouldn't call him my guy. Your guy is not going to know his opponent until the winner of that match, and neither will we. All right, let's see. Hmm. All 
Ooh, this one also looks pretty cool. So what is this one? Okay, I might go for yeah, this one. Wow, this actually is pretty cool. All right. Oh, we have to hold it. Okay. Let's choose some nice face templates. Let's go all the way to the top. I'll start from there. Actually, this one looks pretty cool. Actually, yeah, this one looks a little bit like me, so let's choose that. Actually, yeah, we'll keep it like that. Except, yeah, I'll keep it like that, it's fine. Most of these don't even have anything, I realized. I do want to go with this, but kind of makes me look like an old man. Keep it. Let's see, wrinkles. Hmm. Actually, I don't want that. Sure, keep that. Wow. Well, go with that. Let's see. All right. Sure. Ooh, how do I? Let's see. Oh, cute the analog stick too. Okay. All right, let's go with that one. Light heavyweight, sure. I like our current attire. Let's go to our name information. There we go. That should be good. All right, presentation name. Let's go with... Let's go with the terror. 
Nah, not the terror. The tornado, sure. Let's go with the tornado. Archangel Let's go with the Tornado Archangel Azrael. That should be good. Oh, I have no custom portraits, okay. That's my ring attire. All right. Let's go. Canada, Ontario, Toronto. There we go. All right. Oh, there's already you. This is awesome. All right, that should work. That's a throw lens. put my letters in there. Alright. 
Or I put it like that. Fighting style. All right. Finish your sharpshooter and spear. Let's do a high flyer. There we go. All right, we'll do that. Oh, we can't do that. Blow, blow. All right. Okay, that works. Sure. We'll do light heavyweight. Don't blow yourself up, young man. You're apt to have a long night. Mr. Regal. Coming in early to help the ring crew, running the ropes while everyone else is still at the hotel, it makes an impression. Thanks. I do my best. Do you? What do you mean? Do you do your best? Apply yourself. You sound like my old math teacher. Well, you came to Raw more than a year ago now. And you've yet to make much of an impression. No titles, no great rivalries, a win-loss record with just enough victories to fly under the radar. A uh, great pep talk? Let me finish. I see your potential. The question is, if you're ready to fulfill it. I'm ready. Good, because as you know, there's a tournament for the WWE Universal Championship tonight. The final slot for Raw will be decided in a match on the kickoff show. One of the combatants will be Dominic Mysterio. That young man has a future, a legacy, a name. The other competitor is you. Thank you, sir. So much. I'll bring my best. Good man. See you do. You're the long shot of this whole night, my boy. You're the dark horse. Beat the odds. All right. Let's go to my entrance. Thank you. 
Okay, yeah, that seems good. Let's go talk to Troy. Oh, good. There you are. I'm Troy Simkin. Associate, but soon to be full-fledged producer. Uh, Troy, we've met several times. You even borrowed my toothbrush once. <laughs> Ribbing you, bro. Anyway, just wanted to make sure you had the lay of the land. I mean, you're already booked tonight, but normally these situations are a good chance to check your social media, talk to other superstars, mess with your attire. All kinds of things. I know I've been these on Raw for a while now. I know how these things work. Okay, fine. Just trying to be helpful. Thanks, but I need to focus on my match. Good idea since the kickoff show is starting soon. Oh, and I wanted to let you know that we won't be needing you for anything after the match, so feel free to head back to the hotel. Why would I go back to the hotel? I expect to win and keep fighting. Of course you do. Well, Good luck. All right. Let's talk to the A-lister, the Miz. Well, look who it is. If it isn't SummerSlam's Dark Horse. That nickname is sticking. Good times. Good times? Is Raw trying to steal SmackDown's WWE Universal title? Between us, what is Regal really up to? Um, giving me an opportunity to win the WWE Universal Championship? He put you in a qualifying match. You think that's some kind of vote of confidence? Come on, don't be naive. I'm not. What are you getting at? You know he has all his royal eggs in the Cody Rhodes basket. He's just trying to set the American Nepo baby up to win. I'll tell you what, the draft starts tomorrow. You beat Dominic, maybe I bring you over to SmackDown in the supplemental. We'll make a big announcement on social media. Oh, you'll post about me? For real? Why would you want me in the tournament instead of Dom anyway? Because I want the WWE Universal title on my show, where it belongs. And I am 100% sure KO will beat you. Not Going a to SmackDown? Man, that is a very generous offer and a wicked smart strategy, Miz. I just, and I don't want to overstep here, but I have just one little thing I'm bumping on. What's that? It's just that I would rather have my fingernails pulled out with needle nose pliers than ever work for an entitled, condescending reality show hack like you. I promise that you will regret that. Miz, this right now, this conversation, talking to you, that's what I regret. All right, let's go to the match. It's the so-called dark horse of the tournament. Let's get this. All right, Dominic well, Mysterio. Will this qualifying match with a ticket to the WWE Universal Ooh. Championship Tournament. And we know who it's going to be called. Dirty Dominic Mysterio. He's a hard man who did hard time. Hard time. He spent one night in jail. Show little respect to Dominic's opponent. You really think this guy has got the stuff to follow in Roman Reigns' footsteps, Saxton? He's been called the Dark Horse for a reason. I don't know if Dominic can withstand much more of this. Dominic needs to reassert himself back in this match. Oh, great. And Mysterio needed that badly. Prime opportunity now for Dominic to get some separation and gather himself. Oh, it's triumphant. Oh, drops the hammer right on the lower back. Oh great. Looking worse for wear in the corner. Oh now. got him. From Get him. Alright, yeah, I know how to do reversals. Can Rana and pressure there being placed onto Dominic. Close line! Off with their head. 
Ronda. Right across the back of the neck. Ouch. Sometimes you just gotta show off and show out. Wow, breathtaking. Standing shooting star. Gets his shoulder up before the two counts. Yeah. Channeling his energy to stay in this matchup. Seated drop kick. And Dominic is failing to offer any resistance here. Yeah, Dominic needs to find an opening fast. Close line Ooh. all the way on to the apron. Oh, but counters oh. a shoulder to the gut. Oh, great. In the face. That was late. Oh, great. Landing uh. the uppercut. And here's a cover. Quick shoulder up. Not Got an it. effective pin attempt. Okay, so how do I do my finisher? Okay, so it's R2 plus square for my signature and R2 plus X for my finisher, okay. Okay. Fantastic. And Dominic is failing to offer any resistance here. Dominic now is going to have to dig down deep. Well scattered reversal there. From the middle rope. Breathtaking Hurricane Rana. He's absorbing some tough hits now. Yeah, Cole, but at this okay, So how do I... Uh, let's see... In the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Wow, oh my gosh! Oof, oh my gosh! Drop kick to the face. Take down. Ah. <laughs> Helicopter spin. This is ridiculous. This is insulting. This is entertaining. That's going to be a moment you want to forget it very soon. Carefully placed stop to the arm. Yeah. Dominic Mysterio. Is that his signature? To his uncle yeah. Dom's opponent feeling the heat. Three amigos. There's that innate lucha style from Mysterio. The adrenaline is flowing in the veins of Dominic now. Momentum has completely shifted to Dominic. Dominic is really remaining Got the aggressor it. here. Really had less than a second to stay alive there. Fails to connect on the springboard. He switches it back around. A running hurricane runner. Beautiful. Standing shooting star press. His arm shot off the mat before one. Not a whole lot of luster behind that kick out. Knees up, the knees up at the last second. Vicious, downright savage club right there. He's getting pushed out of the defensive. This is where endurance becomes so important in the late stages of the match. Look at this. Trying to shatter the ankle. Assailing the joints of the leg. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Ref still counting, close to calling it. Hurry back in. Boom, what a forearm. And misses on the springboard. There's some power behind that punch. No signs of either combatant backing down. Slugging away with everything they've got. So much pride, so much resiliency on display. Oh. A kick to the gut. It's 
Twists the arm and a work in the arm and then a kick right to the ribs. And Dominic is now dictating the pace. Yeah, Dominic's firing on all cylinders. From the top, he paid for that one. Oh man, big time. And did you hear the impact of that? A running hurricane runner. Ridiculous standing shooting star. Oh, he's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Oh, look out. Oh, oh, oh. Close a guillotine leg drop. And that's going to impair. Up and over. Selena Del Sol. Can that finish Dominic? He's still in this fight. How close was that? That was about as close as it could get without it all being over for him. I can see it in the eyes from here. Disbelief. Unbelievable how this one is still going on. Oh, got the knees up. Could be a big turnaround here. Merciless looking blow. And there's the cover. Shoulder up before the count started. How'd he do that? What a crossbody. And Dominic just taunting his opponent now. That drop kick in the corner. Perfectly executed. Shooting star. Come on, did you see that? Cover! Two! Wards off the pin at two! And you gotta think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. Strong kick. Oh, stomping away. Uh oh, look out! Double leg drop. Oh, you can tell he's feeling it now. This fight is pumping him up. And Dominic's resolve might be wavering here. Dominic needs to reassert himself back in this match. There's the dive. Oh, no, wait, maybe not. You got fooled again, Byron. He's getting fired up now, really feeding off this crowd. Gloating and put your attention back to the match. Oh, oh my gosh! Springboard misses the target. Up and up. This is all right. Final spot in the WWE Universal Championship Tournament. What a win. Impressive, but somehow he's going to have to find a way to string together three more victories before the night's over. After Silence's defeat of Dominic Mysterio in a qualifier, Mayo fit fight Owens fight in the first round of the WWE Universal Championship Tournament. I can guarantee that the winner, not Silence, will be the most must-see champion on my show. Smackdown. Alright, guys, this is where I'm gonna end the video. If you guys enjoyed, then don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Zombie Apocalypse.